Three, two. Lansdowne Avenue is the scene of the city's latest murder. This is where a man was shot and killed early this morning. So right now the crime scene is contained to a couple of houses here on the street. But for most of the day, about half a block was shut down for the investigation. As police piece together what happened here, residents are left shaken by the gun violence. It, you know, anytime there's gunfire in a neighborhood, it could be. Uh, it's always a concern. Shots rang out around 1.30 this morning. Several neighbors heard the bangs and called 911. A mother who lives directly across the street tells us the violence is too close to home. This is just like, I think, 50 meters from my kid's bedroom. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm terribly shocked, actually. I'm still processing this. A man believed to be 20 years old was rushed to hospital with serious injuries and was pronounced dead shortly after. Witnesses tell us they saw him collapsed on the front porch of this home. And police say a second man, potentially connected to the murder, walked into a hospital with minor gunshot wounds. We're trying to determine if the other person is involved in the actual homicide that we're investigating. What his role or how uh, he is involved is yet to be determined. Numerous evidence markers were scattered on the roadway. Our cameras captured a pair of red Crocs on the street and a blue Tesla being towed away by police. The focus of the investigation was on these semi-detached homes that appear to be multi-unit dwellings. At least one of these units is operating as an Airbnb. We spoke to a couple of men who are staying here. They told me off camera they heard lots of footsteps and banging and then saw two men fighting on the porch. They say a third man was holding a gun. We do believe that there's an association uh, between where the shooting occurred and the front of the residence, but the whole area is a crime scene. Um, the reason being is uh, we do a thorough examination of the immediate area. But again, it's, it's a collection of evidence will determine exactly where the person was and then we'll uh, proceed from there. As police canvass the neighborhood for information and possible security video, residents say violence like this is happening too often. About a month ago or so, there was a guy walking around with a gun and uh, there were cops uh, with uh, their guns walking around looking for him. And then not even a week ago, there was a stabbing at Dundas West there. For it to happen in your backyard like that, definitely, you know, it's uh, alarming. Right now, little is known about the victim. Police say they are in the process of contacting family. And at this point, uh, no details have been released on suspects. Investigators telling media earlier today that they are hoping to have video or images soon. On Lansdowne Avenue, Shauna Hunt, City News.